Hey guys, what's going on? It's me, your boy Samson Biggs. Boom, and I'm here with another video because we just got to keep on talking about uh, uh, this Tory Lane's NFT album that his uh, fans are starting to realize. Uh, the people who bought the album are starting to realize some things. And I've also been doing a lot of research too, you know, just to, uh, um, you know. Because that's what you got to do. If you're going to be speaking on something, you got to do a lot of research on it. You got to understand it. You got to know what you're doing. Um, a lot of times, uh, you got to watch the hype. You know what I'm saying? A lot of things are all hype. And uh, be careful. A lot of things are all hype and no substance. I mean, you come to find out things after the fact. Um, you know, make sure you're doing your research. I've been reading a lot of people's uh tweets who bought the album and it's kind of scary these young people it's 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 scary because uh they do things and i understand it when i was young i did the same thing i would do i would do stuff without researching but see the difference is when i was young there was no internet when i was young you couldn't really research anything you know if you did research it you had to like you know uh uh you know go to the library or something just <laughs> like the research wasn't there and if you did like the internet was real like real janky back in the day so like you know it just wasn't but now it's at your fingertips so everything you can do you can do some solid research on it so anyway that's what i did i did some research on the tory lane's when it's dark nft album okay um and i did some research on ENFT, uh, this this website, Immersive, um, that actually is uh, where the album, where the NFT album is being hosted. Um, and so I, I did some research, find out more and more about this thing. So, okay, let's get into the big thing. A lot of people are starting to realize, they're starting to get mad that they bought this album because with ENFT, um, you are able to buy the album without any gas fees, okay? If you are heard gas fees and like, what the heck's the gas fee? It's very important you understand gas fees, okay? Um, in the NFT world, gas fees are something that you need to to think about. Um, what's a gas fee? Well, when you purchase an NFT album, there's a gas fee, okay? It, basically. Um, NFT is on a blockchain, okay, which means like all these computers are connected, right? And there is uh, mentors or, uh, you know, it's it's kind of hard to explain because it, it's, it's, but there's, anyway, there's these uh, uh, people that basically they do your transfers for you. Okay, kind of like the same way with like, you know, if you put in, you have a debit card and you go to the, you know, you go to the checkout and you, you, you do your checkout, uh, you know, Visa is doing that whole little transaction. So they're going to take a little bit of money off the top from you and from, say, Walmart, right? That's what uh, Visa is going to do. So in the, in, the, in the blockchain world, there are people that do this transaction for you. Um, people or bots, I don't know what exactly it is, but your transaction has to be done by uh, uh, someone or something, whatever. So they get a transaction fee for that. They get a called a gas fee. And here's the thing. These gas fees can get expensive. <laughs> you can buy something for like $20 and the gas fee be like $50. It's just crazy. It's crazy how much the gas fees are. Like I've been, uh, like you know, researching a lot of people doing NFTs and stuff like that, and a lot of times people don't even do the sale because the gas fee is so expensive. You know, so say you bought your album for a dollar, you try and sell it for twenty dollars, but the gas fee is fifty dollars. Well, you just lost thirty dollars. <laughs> So, yeah, be careful. Be careful with those gas fees. Make sure you understand in the gas fees. Uh, another thing, too, with the Tory, the NFT album, what turns out, because uh, I am I went to this, you know, this ENFT site, and I started seeing 
something that I didn't really quite understand. And what I was seeing was, it's a streaming NFT. I didn't pick up on that. Now, like, if you look right here, uh, see right here, this little little thing, uh, uh, you know, one NFT streaming, one NFT album streaming, seven new music tracks, uh, seven matching pieces of artwork for one buck. And then if you see right here in the little parentheses, $1 USD plus applicable fees. They don't really tell you about the gas fees, <laughs> but uh, those gas fees are crazy. Okay, so then on top of that, right? Uh, you know, you're you're looking through this, through this, through the site, right? And you know, you got to find out about the 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 streaming and downloading. Here's one, right? You bought the album for a dollar. Now, uh, can I download the song? You know, you bought it. You should be able to download it, right? Nope. Can't download the songs. Wait, what a minute. Wait, wait a minute. Wait a minute. I can't download the songs. I just bought the album for a dollar. <laughs> you bought the NFT. You bought the NFT. You, you, you. Uh, what? I can't download these songs. I just bought them, man. I can't download them. No. You can stream them. And you can only stream them on this ENFT web website. So like the plot thickens, man. Like a lot of people are starting to understand, they're starting to wake up to the fact. Not only that, you can't download the songs. Um uh when you try to transfer your also there's like some kind of embargo where you can't sell your uh you can't resell the NFTs until like the twenty fourth or twenty eighth so there's some kind of embargo where they're they're making you you can't you can't even resell yet so it's kind of kind of kind of crazy there's a lot of you know little things that people aren't thinking about not understanding um and uh, people are people are getting pissed the gas fees alone are going to ruin a lot of things gas fees alone are going to ruin a lot of things because people, when they find out that they have to pay that fifty dollars, a hundred dollars on top of their, you know, whatever they're paying for, people are gonna be mad. So yeah, I mean, a lot of things surrounding this NFT uh, 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 album, and just because it's it's just it's different, it's different. <laughs> and then like, so you go back to. Twitter, and you got people like, I don't know what the fuck uh, NFT is, but I bought three. I'm praying it pays for my college fund. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know, shit, I bought five, hopefully, yo. <laughs> it's so sad, man. It's so sad the way, you know, praying we make it big. You know what I'm saying? Like, this is the thing, man. He really did put a number on these young men thinking that I bought five too, you know, hopefully it's gonna, uh, you know, like, you know, hopefully we make some solid money for this, you know, like, hopefully, uh, it's, it's just, it's crazy, man. You gotta, you gotta do a lot of research before you do things, man. You gotta do a lot of research. And granted, you know what? If just if it's just five, you bought five of them, and you you can't do nothing with them, then it's you know it's it's just five bucks, right? It's not a big deal, right? You know, I guess the, the, the real the real people now. Don't get me wrong. There will be maybe one or two people that buy this album NFT for over what it's worth. I have no doubt about that. There will be some uh, NFT people, because there's some people buying stuff like, if you go to OpenSea, there's some people buying some just the stupidest things. Like, they are dumb. I, I just been scrolling through OpenSea and all, this, all these different NFTs. Like, really, for somebody like me who, you know, I screw around with Photoshop, I screw around with, 
you know, I may screw around with music. I screw around with all these different things. And let me tell you, the NFT hype right now is just ridiculous. And some of the things that I see that people are buying, I'm just like, you going to pay $300 for this rat that is blinking a, a gif, <laughs> a blinking gif? You're crazy. <laughs> You're crazy, you know. Uh, people paying like $1,000 for some really dumb things. Is Tory Lane's album going to do that? Maybe one or two. Somebody's going to hit the lotto. Somebody is. Not everybody, though. Not everybody. Not all people who bought, you know, maybe a couple people, they're going to get some, some dough out of it. But the rest of them, they ain't getting no dough out of it. But yeah, it's your boy Samson Biggs. Learn about the gas fees. If you bought the album and you don't know what a gas fee is, learn about the gas fee because the gas fee is going to be a big factor in whether you sell anything. Um, uh, also, the gas fee to transfer anything. So you bought the NFT album on enft.com, right? If you want to bring it over and you want to transfer it to OpenSea, to sell it on OpenSea, guess what? There's gonna be a, a there's gonna be a gas fee for that. So it's gonna cost you money just to even transfer uh, your NFT over to there. You know, so learn about the transfer fees, the gas fees, all that stuff. It's your boy Samson Biggs. It's keeping you in the loop, letting you know. Hey, be smart, do your research, get it done.